Warm wishes everyone. Myself Grishta and my friend Hiranmay, we both have developed a project called Valian. This project is a part of our Vihan thing that we have, that we have uh, developed in our college. Yeah, this is a certain video that has inspired us to create this project. As you can see, this is the amount of plastic that has been collected from a single beach. Imagine the plastic that will be collected from beaches all over the world. As you can see in this video, there are certain volunteers and NSS volunteers who are helping to clean the beaches. So I think we as students who have created this website and you as audience who are part of this can also be uh, contribute in making this uh, project and in helping to clean the beaches. As you can see into the project, uh, as the heading prefers, this website we have created to create an awareness about the amount of plastic that has been collected in the beaches. And in the same website, we have also created a shopping page where you can buy the same recycled products, plastic products that you have collected from the beach. What does this shopping page do? It helps in creating a revenue and the revenue again goes back for us to go to the further beaches and clean the further beaches. So it's like a cycling process. As you can see in the next slide, we have used this following technologies. These are the technologies that we have learned in our first year as a part of our Vihan, which are HTML, CSS, JavaScript and Bootstrap. We use the same technologies for creating our website. As you can see, this is the website that we have created with a name called Valian. So why did we name it Valian? As you can see, Valian is actually a, a species of aquatic uh, earth where it is the loneliest whale in the earth. So I personally believe that if we keep using plastic and keep throwing into the beaches, we will also be the loneliest species on the earth. So I've chosen this particular name for this project. As you can see, this is the main uh, main page wherein, uh, where I've given a description about what our project is. And when you keep scrolling down, this is an about us section where there is an our mission and our vision. Our mission is to raising awareness about destruction of the plastic. And our vision is as an audience, I want you all to become a volunteer and also to be, buy our recycled products, which will help in cleaning more beaches further. When you go down, yeah, we have just created four different carts where the number of volunteers were there and plastic. And these are our services, which are reduced, reuse and recycle. We go and live on this motto. And here, this is the nav bar that we have created where you click on a particular section, it, it makes you travel to the particular section. So here I asked you to join us and become a volunteer. But how do you do this? Here there is a button that we have created. When you click on it, it will make you travel through another page where a volunteer form opens, where you can fill your details, specific details, and you can give your email ID or password, and you can recheck the password and you can submit it anywhere on this page. Or you can click in the part, you'll go back to the main page. So as I've told in the introduction, we have also created a shopping page where you can shop the recycle project. So let's look into this. When you click here buy, yeah, it travels to your shopping page where uh, we have featured our uh, respective projects. There is a chair, there is a Microsoft mouse and a waste. This all the projects that you, uh, sorry, products that you look into here are the ones that have been created from the uh, beach plastic. We have given um, a certain rating and also a certain amount of amount for you to buy and when you keep scrolling down yeah there is a footer where you can come and contact us there are our details and also about how, how can you shop through it so there is a particular thing called shop when you click on it yeah it makes you it will show you for different products when you keep on going it will show you the number of products are there for example if i click this particular project uh, product it will open on another page where you can like go through several things. How did we do this? We do use this JavaScript uh, to make this work. Here you can select the size of the project that you want, the number of uh, things you want to buy. You can add them to cart and you can also buy them. Then if you go to blog, then you might have a doubt. Okay, well, how do I have a guarantee that all the products that you have seen here are from beach plastic? How, how can I trust you guys? So here we have created a blog page where we, have, where we have described how the plastic has been created. Here there is a Microsoft uh, mouse that has been actually designed by the Microsoft itself. So we have given you certain details about how the mouse was made, uh, from which beach the mouse was made. We have created a certain uh, data for you to read. So the number of products that are there in the shopping page, you will find the same number of things in the blog also. So then there is a contact page. 
yeah so let's talk so if you want to contact us if you want to share our further details or your wishes or any queries that you have you can contact us through this contact page here we have given the google maps here also we have given the head office the timings of the office open and all here there is a little uh, message that you can fill your email id the subject you want to talk about and your message you can send us uh, yeah this is the about section so yes so i hope all of you who are listening to this video be a part of this project and help in saving the world a little bit more shall we look into the code about how did we make make this so yeah yeah this is the code that we have used to make the project you can see we have created n number of html files css files and javascript files to make this happen this is the uh, main page of the this is the code of this main page yes yeah this main page that we have created all this the code the, uh, sorry all this data which is there in this the code has been written in this particular thing and we have also linked several things for making this page look as attractive as possible as you can see for let me show you a little bit thing yes yeah this particular thing i have told you when you click on this image it keeps on changing when this keep changing the details also keep changing how did we make this happen so if you go to this code yeah here we use the javascript uh, code language for making that happen we have given a variable named main image document got get, get elements which is uh, a method in javascript also we have used like on click uh, method or a submit button where whenever you click on it the image keeps changing and we have given index 0 1 2 3 as a coding subject you know the index always starts with 0 so if there are four images we have given three indexes this is the javascript that code that we have used for make for making that happen and we have also used several css codes for making it happen we have we have written so much css lines of code for making it look as attractive and as appealing as possible for you to scroll through the website so let's look at some interesting thing yes so here we have also created this project uh, available for any kind of device it's not like only a laptop this particular website will open it will open in any uh, any kind of device let me show you that yeah this is the laptop device uh, for the device laptop the website if i click this for a mobile screen yeah for a mobile screen the website will look like this but it's completely responsive all the things uh, will be as appealing to you as any other device you will also look for a, like a ipad yeah it is also appealing for ipad and everything will work in this yes so yeah how did we make this happen how did we make this website responsible for every other device possible we use something very interesting in the coding language in css known as media queries yeah what does media queries uh, make you do they'll help you be uh, be the page responsible for in any device possible here we have given like minimum width 900 pixels like for any mm, device that mean that minimum width is 900 pixels or more the uh, page will be responsive then we have given minimum width 13000 1370 pixels so we given seven and media media queries for making it happen for any other uh, device so this is the project that we have created so i hope you all like the project and on this very occasion i also like to thank our gk sir uh for giving us this opportunity for making us display our talents and i also like to thank the vihan department the vihan faculty unas sir avinash sir for giving us an opportunity and encouraging our thoughts to be such beautiful beautiful projects so thank you sir thank you everyone